another treat for you today i'm doing a very english what we call pudding or you might call dessert and it's called eve's pudding very very simple hey everyone i hope you're hungry because jeanette's gonna be dishing out some mighty fine food oh my please comment subscribe and like and let's get our baking on that's right so I've sort of planned ahead of time I've greased a three pint Pyrex dish with butter and I've peeled cored and sliced six apples so that's basically your base so I've five ounces of sultanas it does say raisins on on the Thing, but you can use anything really you don't have to use them you can just use apples you know it's individual preference really but I made this a few weeks ago and we enjoyed it that much that Mr P says can you make it again I says I can do better than that I'll vlog it as well so you just sprinkle these on your apples Right, I'm going to do the uh, sponge bit on top because that's more or less done now. Um, 100 grams of soft brown sugar, 200 grams of uh, butter, to this mixture you want 4 eggs. And last ingredient is 200 grams of self-raising flour. All there's left to do now is you basically just put the batter on you. That's all done and ready to go in the oven. Um, it's got to be on uh, gas mark four. 180 degrees centigrade or no sorry 180 degrees Fahrenheit or 160 degrees centigrade for 45 minutes so I'll see you in a little while wow. right it's been in the oven now and this is the Eve's pudding as you can see a lovely moist layer of sponge on top if you want to spin the camera around Mr P you can see the raisins and the apple at the bottom so uh, I'm not going to touch it because it's just come out of the oven so it is rather hot so um, if you haven't already subscribe to me leave a comment and leave me a thumbs up and we will be having this for our pudding tomorrow with some custard but you can really have it with anything cream ice cream but we we having it with custard so we'll be having it after a Sunday lunch. So I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye.